Welcome along. Two more Dynasty Warriors 3. We're going to be doing the Battle of Tongate in this episode. Is this the first time we've done No, I don't think it is, no. I think we've done it before. Maybe we've sh I think it was with Juju. But this time we're doing it with Zhang Liao. More badass. So it looks like it's going to be quite a quick mission, but it's a bit longer than the last time. 11 minutes ish. My child Pandy and my die are. They're beefed up. They are beefed up. Of course, we could uh, potentially get Han Sui on our side if we play our cards right. We follow certain ways. After unleashing his fleet on Chibi, Kalka sweeps aside Zhou Yu's plot, resulting in a great victory for the Wei Empire. Emerging victorious from the brutal battle, Cao Cao extends his reach south all the way to Jiangdong. In 211, Cao Cao and his army head west. Along the way, Ma Chao, Han Sui, and other members of the group known as the Guangzhong Ten lie in wait for Cao Cao's troops. Fearing an attack by Cao Cao, Ma Chao and his men gather their forces at Tong Gate. Cao Cao, not interested in Guangzhong, has his eyes set on the lands beyond. However, Ma Chao, his father having been killed by Cao Cao, stands before the Wei ruler, vengeance smoldering within his eyes. I think Ma Chao's father, Ma Teng, was involved in some kind of assassination plot against Cao Cao. I think he was working with Liu Bei, and Ma Teng was executed because of that. I don't really feel that good about this fight. Must you? Always look for justice in battle. I will do anything, anything to obtain Guangzhou. Zhu Huan, I need your help for that. Did the narrator just say that Guangzhou wasn't his objective? Well, I shall prepare for the journey north. Lord Coco! Food has been prepared! You can't fight on an empty stomach! I think perhaps it is better this way. Huh? They're just a mixed unit. They're no match for us. Jia Ha Wan, Kao Ren, station yourselves in front of the Tan Gate. Ju Huan. Send a detachment to cross to the south. Find all the hidden enemy units and destroy them. Ah, uh, back when Dynasty Warriors had good English voice acting. Don't get too hasty. That totally isn't a reference to the awful English voice acting in Dynasty Warriors 9, which I recently experienced myself for the first time. Don't get too hasty. We must wait for reinforcements. That one line there from Ji Hao You Want probably has more character in it than anything I've heard so far in Dinosaur's 9. In fact, I actually had to change it over to Chinese voice acting for the first time in my entire life. So, Machao is gonna charge us. It's a good idea to stay away from Machao. But you wanna take care you wanna take out Madai and Pangde. And um, there's a very good reason for taking out those guys, because you need to take out Madai and Pangde in order for Han Sui to defend. If you don't kill Mandai and Pangde, Hans Free won't defect and you won't gain an officer to your cause, which is obviously a good thing. So you definitely need to take out Mandai and Pangde. And Mandai is down. With a nice. Oh, an attack up plus two? The Lieutenant Commanders in the last episode were given us attack up plus fours. That's a bit bad. I guess it was maybe to make that stage a little more, more um, worthwhile. We will attack them with the southern unit first. So Zhu Huang is gonna circle around and attack the camp from the rear. But before you leave and go and join him, you should take out these guys. The same if you're playing as Zhu Huang, you wanna stick around here and take care of Pangde and Han Sui, uh, Pangde and Machit Madai before going down there. Don't get too deep. Wait here for support. Yep, there's the there there's the message. 
Yep, he's in trouble already. You can usually tell by what message plays um, how they're going to fare against the enemy unit. That message just there was him saying, yeah, I'm gonna need help here or I'm gonna die. Jump cut up here. For the power of editing. There's the Mushu Wang. Dim Sum is just across the map. Right over here, actually. I don't actually think we can gain any more life in Mushu for Zhang Liao. I think he's buffed out. And we have like two officers here. Yank you and who's you on? Let's take them down and move into the camp and finish this battle. Yank you is going down without too much of a fight. Oh, oh, I spoke too soon, it seems. I defeated an officer. Nah, I really didn't. Alright, who's you on? You're next. I'm thinking of doing Zhu Huang's Mushu next. I've not, we've, we've not played a Zhu Huang ever. But then again, Zhao Yuan's one is looking quite tempting. I guess we'll just have to wait and see. I'm sewer. Put away your soul. Cow Cow, what are you up to? You and I have been friends for a long time. Come now, don't you think we can just talk this over? Ah, Han Sui's negotiations. Now, down here, we have Li Kan, another enemy officer, obviously. He has quite high morale, in fact all the enemy officers have quite high morale on this stage. But morale doesn't matter when you're up against Zhang Liao of Wei. Ouch. That was painful. And there's Chen Yi. Five star morale. It's not awful. Not ideal, but not awful. There's still three star morale. That would be great. Gotta love the juggle. Another thing you can't do in Dennis Warriors 9 as well. Well, you can, I guess, but it's awkward. And there goes the defection. And so he's now on our side. I mean, we probably don't really need to get Hansu on our side, but it's nice to get him, I guess. Because it's the way the stage is supposed to go. I mean, it's just supposed to get Hansu. It's historical. I don't know what I'm doing here. <laughs> but there's Chen Yang, the last enemy officer on the field. I mean, I need to get that attack and defense boost, you know what I mean? I may be buffed out on as far as health and mushu goes, but come on, my attack and defense need a little bit of work. Especially if I'm going to do a hard playthrough run. Left himself wide open and vulnerable there. Come on. Oh, really? One sliver of health left, and you're gonna do that? And Juju almost stole my kill. Wasn't even. I didn't even get an attack boost or defense boost. It was a stupid weapon box. So now for the big guy, my child. That didn't do half as much damage as it should have, I think. Oddly enough. We're both shoring up. Oh, wait, okay, maybe I'm not as well. I was gonna say, we're both defending quite well. Oh. Man, Machao really does not want me to hit him. He's like mashing the block button. Why is Jaiju's force going around that way? Like, I mean at this point in the game they could probably just march through Tongate, 
rather than going around it. Anyway, my child is almost done. We're getting there. Oh, damn. Still didn't do half as much damage as it. Is he gonna have a heal? No. That was his chance to heal and he didn't take it. Maybe... I think it was because my allies were too, um... Uh, too much of a nuisance for him. Ah, and he's dead anyway. I died with no regrets. I mean, you didn't manage to kill Sal Sal, so that's probably a pretty big regret, I would think. Well, that's a victory for us, another mission stage down. We only have two more to go for Zhang Liao, and then it's a brand new character. Eleven minutes and twenty-five seconds, I'll take it. And a halberd, that's awful for this stage in the game. That is an awful pickup. Damn you, Chen Ying. I don't know why I didn't just press X. I have no idea. I don't know what pa I don't know what past me was thinking. That's it, guys. We only have two more stages to go, and then we're gonna be finishing Jean Leal's mission. So thanks for sticking around. I hope you come back next time.